Hey friends, this is Atif Hope here. Well, and welcome to the new update on storage. Storage has already broken out a very big and major resistance of a big falling wedge pattern. And now we need to break out two more major resistance levels. And this was, by the way, my last video on storage that I shared a few days ago, almost four days ago with you. when I was showing you these three resistance levels. If you take a look at the seven day time frame chart, then you can see that uh, this is the resistance of a falling wedge pattern that storage has already broken out. If I remove the uh, other trend lines, then it will be more visible to you. You can see that this was the falling wedge pattern. And now the price is stuck inside this down channel. And at the same time, uh, it is also moving inside in this big, very huge uh, down channel. If I again remove other trend lines, then you can see that it is also moving inside this very, very big and wide down channel at the same time as well. And now we need to break out first this down channel, the smaller down channel. Then we will need to break out the bigger down channel in order to start a very, very massive move. Already we have broken out this big falling wedge pattern. And in today's video, we will analyze this move. And I would also like to share with you my most recent trade signal for storage that I shared a few days ago on the 18th of September 2024 with my members. And this signal produced almost 18% pump. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because there I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me there in the video's description I've shared. So let's start analysis. And first of all, let me begin with my most recent trade signal for stores that I shared on the 18th of September 2024 with my members. And that is a harmonic position reversal bad move. Uh, not a bad, a garlic pattern that stores formed with Bitcoin pair on a four hour time frame chart. And this was the complete trade signal, the buying's on and the sell targets on and the stop loss. And now if I play this chart, then you can see that the price and of storage started a very, very nice reversal. First it uh, dropped a, uh, more down inside this buying zone. Then, then we had a very, very nice reversal. And this was almost 18% pump only on this four hour time frame chart. And if you would like to catch each other pumps before they happen, then you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member, because there I'm sharing such trading signals for you on the daily basis. And I've already shared the links to join me there in the video's description you can find. Now let me to take you to the live chart of storage. And first of all, let me to show you the daily time frame chart. And here you can see that the price is moving inside uh, this down channel on this daily time frame chart. A few days ago, we had a fake out from this channel, but the price and again re-entered the channel. And right now, again, it is trying to break out the resistance of this channel. By the way, it entered the channel here in the month of November 2023. And since then, it is moving inside this channel. In case of breaking out, the price and can hit the target here at the top of the channel, approximately at $1.21. And in case of another rejection, the price and can test the support of the channel somewhere here, approximately at $0.18. Cents. And if the price and break out, breaks out the channel and hits the target for the breakout from this channel, then it can also break out the bigger down channel as well. Now we are switched to the seven days time frame chart. And here you can see that we have already broken out a very big falling wedge pattern. After that, the price and got rejected by the resistance of the bigger down channel. And now we will need to break out this bigger resistance of the big down channel in order to continue this value to the upside. And before that, obviously, we will need to break out this down channel. Then the price and can try to break out the bigger down channel. And if the price and breaks out this bigger down channel, then target for the breakout from this big down channel and the previous falling wedge pattern are at the same level uh, here at the top of the wedge, somewhere between $4 to $5. So this was the update so far. I hope that you've liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member because there I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me there in the video description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.